Hello friends, welcome back to Friend of Health. So today we have a very important announcement regarding the uh, date of UPSC examination. So UPSC.gov.in. If you search in Google UPSC, the first result itself is UPSC.gov.in website, the official website. So this website, when you click, you can see some scrolls coming up. So first is about the post of medical officer in Ayurveda, Ayurveda. Then the third one, you can see here addendum notice. 36th post of medical officer or research officer homeopathy in ministry of ayush and uh, also the seventh post uh, for the um, general duty medical officer homeopathy so the uh, both scroll you can see any uh, one of that you have to click and you can see an addendum notice so you click on this pdf or download that pdf so this is very very important so this is a two page uh, addendum notice so union public service commission addendum notice to candidates reference union public service commissions so you, we already have two notifications uh, uh, regarding the homeopathic medical officer and research officer post the 36 post uh, uh, one notification came which came in the july month uh, so july 25th it was published and uh, we had applied before 13th of august so that one exam and the second advertisement uh, 9 bar 2020 item number 4 uh, for vacancies of seven post of general duty medical officer homeopathy and that uh, came in the month of August, 22nd August 2020. And it was uh, like uh, we had to apply before uh, 10th September. So these two exams, uh, they have decided to make a combined exam. So that is the uh, addendum note is about. So the commission have decided to conduct a combined computer-based recruitment test, CBRT. So if you see the 2016 and 2017 UPSC Medical Officer Homeopathy exams, it is called CBRT, Computer-Based Recruitment Test. So this time it is a combined test of two uh, different advertisement. So combined computer based recruitment test for shortlisting the candidates for the above mentioned post. So there will be an interview. So they are speaking about that later. So we will see the date. This is very very important. Date of examination 20th December 2020 Sunday. It is a Sunday and it is in the forenoon session in the morning from 9.30 to 11.30 am. But the candidates reporting time at exam center is 8 am. So 8 am you have to report. So uh, only those candidates shortlisted in the combined CBRT and who fulfill all eligibility condition of the post shall be called for interview. So you have to attend uh, the CBRT exam and you have to be uh, fulfilling the eligibility conditions. Then you will be called for interview. So that means uh, there will be a cutoff mark and all. We will come to that later. So this part is very, very important. The examination centers. So center code, if you have applied for Ahmedabad, it is uh, 01, the center code. So later you will be able to download the admit card etc. So here you can see the different sender uh, codes. So Cochin you have a sender, Kolkata you have a sender. Allow. Everywhere uh, like all uh, main parts of the country you have senders. So this is a scheme of test. Many students are having doubt because they have not appeared for the 2017 exam. Uh, so they have a doubt about the scheme of the test, how many negative mark etc. So everything is clearly given in this two pages uh, addendum notice. So it, the test will be of two hours duration. So two hours duration, all questions will carry equal marks. The test will have objective type questions with multiple choice of answer. So MCQ type question, uh, it is objective type questions and all will have equal marks. There is no description, anything descriptive type questions or anything. Two hours time is there. That is 120 minutes and uh, the medium of the test will be English only. There will be penalty for wrong answers every wrong answer will carry a deduction of one third this is very very important uh, when you see um, the pg entrance a a p g t you have a, a advantage of one fourth only will be deducted but here in upsc one third mark will be deducted if no answer is marked for a question there will be no penalty for that question the test will carry a maximum of 300 marks from this we can assume that there will be 100 questions and each question will carry 3 marks and each negative uh, wrong uh, answer will carry a negative 1 or a minus 1 so that is an assumption we are not sure about that uh, if we get information we will comment or uh, we will do a new video so here uh, what information we have is every wrong answer will carry a deduction of one third of the mark assigned to the question the test will carry a maximum of 300 marks so and two hours duration that is the information we have now and syllabus of the test is the syllabus of the question paper shall broadly cover all the core areas normally included in the bachelor's degree of homeopathy medicine and surgery that is bhms program of indian universities 
so as far as uh, bhms syllabus is concerned uh, the subjects we have to cover uh, for this uh, syllabus of the test next is three notes uh, not one note two and note three these are very important intimation about the venue of the recruitment test will be communicated to the candidate in due course combined cbrt and the interview shall carry a 75 is to 25 weightage for those candidates shortlisted out of the combined computer based recruitment test and those who qualify in the interview so those who qualify in the interview uh, will be having a shortlist uh, they will make a shortlist and that shortlist will uh, be based on a weightage of 75 is to 25 for the combined uh, uh, computer based recruitment test uh, they will take a 75 percentage weightage and 25 percentage weightage from the interview per performance so this is the weightage also and standard of suitability for the interview for candidates belonging to various categories is fixed as under so this is the cut off mark or standard of suitability for the interview so each candidates in the categories like general or ews economically weaker session category 50 and above mark or cut off should be there and uh, obc 50 it's it may not be mark it will be like percentage so 50 and above percentage and obc uh, the backward communities 45 and above on relaxed standards sc and st 40 and above on relaxed standards and pwd uh, general obc anything uh, who the categories uh, belonging to the pwd uh, 40 and above on relaxed standards and note 3 is very very important no request for change of test sender will be entertained whatever you have applied for examination sender uh, that uh, remains the same so you cannot change it now so this is all about the notification now so this is very very important the time is uh, 9 30 am to 11 30 am uh, important time is 8 am the examination date is 20th december 2020 so this exam will happen in the month, uh, year of 2020 itself and uh, the uh, maximum marks is 300 and each negative or wrong answer will carry a deduction of one third of the marks all the best wishes for our uh, viewers and uh, we hope that you are following our previous post uh, like uh, uh, the useful and informative uh, series like uh, 10 in 1 high yield points, the Boric uh, Material Medica series and also other uh, useful question paper discussions and UPSC series. So all the best wishes and stay in touch and share our channel with your friends those who are preparing for Union Public Service Commission, Medical Office Homeopathy, Research Office Homeopathy and General Duty Medical Office Homeopathy Post Examination. All the best.